everyone. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to Angel Love 333. Hope everybody is doing great. We're going to do your reading here in a moment. Just a couple things while I'm shuffling here. Everything you need to know is in the description box. There will be an extended reading link below. If this reading resonates with you, you can check it out. Uh, in the extended, I will look at the next three weeks energy and I do treat it like a personal reading. Also below, details on how to win a free personal reading and basically you just need to be a subscriber like the video and leave a comment also below i have started posting again on my meditation relax calm channel uh, a lot of different videos for relaxing meditation chakra balancing i uh, got some soulmate twin flame activations um, and what else some holiday stuff so check it out if you like i do appreciate all of your support and with that, let's get started. All right, Gemini, let's see what the energy is here for you. What's the energy here for Gemini? What's the energy here for Gemini? All right. Got the lovers. Your energy popping out right there. First card. All right. We got the Eight of Cups. We have the Magician. We got the Eight of Wands. We got Justice, Libra Energy. Three major Arcana cards already. We got the Two of Pentacles. We got the Hierophant, Strong Taurus Energy. We have the Ten of Wands. And we have the Strength card. It's really interesting, Gemini, because I was just thinking. Uh, wouldn't it be interesting if all four corners were major arcana and the center card is a major arcana card here, okay? I feel like this one, this one was st uh, sticking out here. So I'm going to put that there with this one as well. Oh, look at that. Another major arcana here with the sun card, okay? So Gemini, whenever I get a lot of major arcana cards here in the read, it's definitely uh, showing me there's a shift in the energy, something important here. So let's go through the cards. I'll go through the cards and then we're going to clarify what is needed. Okay. I feel here, uh, Gemini, in the center of your reading, you do have the justice, which is popping out at me. Um, I do feel like there is something here where maybe you're feeling like you either need more clarity or feeling like there's a situation where, you know, you just weren't feeling like it was fair to you is the energy that I get here. I also pick up to uh, definitely get there could be some sort of communication, uh, love energy here, right? With that eight of wands here and the two of pentacles. Now, I feel like there could be a situation uh, between you and someone that's been on and off. Definitely get that energy. But I also pick up an energy of um, you may be trying to decide here if this is something that you want to pursue with someone. So there's someone I'm feeling like there is, you know, some imbalance here on and off energy, right? Not feeling a whole lot of consistency here. Now, you got the lovers, uh, your energy, we have the eight of wands and we have the hierophant. Now, for some of you, I feel like this could be with some, be somebody either you see yourself or saw yourself in a relationship with this person or I'm getting here, this could be somebody that you were in a past relationship with. Now, you have the eight of cups, you have the justice and you have the Ten of Wands. I'm going to clarify this Eight of Wands to see what that is about. Okay. So I feel like with that Justice card, I almost get an energy here too because we have the Sun card on the bottom of the deck. There's something I feel that's about to happen, Gemini. I feel like there could be um, an apology or you receive some sort of clarity with this communication that is coming through to you. And I feel what's happening here, it's the end of a difficult time. And it may be that maybe this was somebody here that you weren't feeling very supported uh, by, but I see an energy here of the end of feeling discontent. So I feel like there's some sort of clarity 
uh, maybe confession or even an apology here. And we have the full card here. So it's bringing about a new beginning here. We also have the magician as well. So I feel like you're manifesting some sort of clarity uh, or a situation coming to some sort of resolution is what I'm getting. I'm probably going to clarify that justice card again. Or a, not again, but I'm going to clarify. We have strong Leo here as well. Uh, very strong Leo with uh, the strength card and the sun card here. Now, we have the three of cups. Okay. So I get the energy here, Gemini. Uh, you know, some of you may have walked away from a situation and you could just be trying to really enjoy life, enjoy your friends. Uh, maybe some of you are actually dating, but I get, a, I really get a strong energy here, Gemini, that there is also um, a chance for you and this person to connect. I definitely see communication. Now, let's see... Um, why this Eight of Wands is here, please? Why is the Eight of Wands here, please? Okay, we got the King of Wands. Yeah, someone uh, is definitely coming towards you, taking action. Okay, got two cards here. We got the Two of Wands and the Ace of Wands. Could be a fire sign, a lot of fire here. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. So I feel like this person has been thinking about you. They've been thinking about the possibilities. There may be some sort of a decision that is being made in this situation with this person. This is someone who wants an opportunity with you. Now you got a, we got a card here sticking out. Um, so yeah, somebody has definitely been thinking about you, trying to gain their own clarity. So I see communication here. Now I'm going to say, Gemini, now it could be too, uh, maybe you just came out of a relationship or a marriage here and some of you, this could be somebody new, all right? Could be somebody new here because I see here too. Now I'm going to say it could be someone you're dealing with. If you're dealing with somebody who is married or you were married, I feel like that is coming to an end here with that justice card. Could be a legal uh, separation or a divorce here as well. Take it how it resonates. Let's see why justice is here, please. Why is justice here? Okay, Knight of Wands. Yeah, King of Swords. Communication, again, someone is coming towards you. Let's pull one more. Let's see what else uh, that has to say. And the wheel, yeah. There's a begin new beginning, a new cycle. Some of you, I'm going to say that Knight of Wands can be a new love. Some of you, I'm going to say, I feel like there could be somebody coming towards you, wanting to confess something, apologize, um, wanting the opportunity here in your situation. You do have the Six of Swords. There could actually be distance, but I feel this is an energy, right? Six of Swords for me is moving on to better things. You know, things are going to get better. So I feel like, the, you know, like I said, this Eight of Cups, the Ten of Wands. So it goes from a situation to where maybe you weren't feeling happy or you weren't feeling content about it, not feeling supported by somebody, or it was just a struggle, and I feel like that's coming to an end here with that wheel. There's a new beginning, a new cycle. Now, let's see why the two of pentacles is here, please. Okay, before I could do anything. All right, we got temperance and we got the hierophant again. So Sagittarius energy and we also have here Taurus. Okay, weighing your options. I am also hearing like what is your higher self telling you about this situation? about what this person has to say. This is coming up in the near future energy. So there's going to be with the magician some sort of action you're, you're gonna need to take here. And it, and it feels like a decision. Gemini, let's see what else we got here. Okay, the hermit, three major arcanas. There's something big going on here, six of cups. It's a soulmate energy here, soulmate energy. Okay, so some of you, like I said, yeah, love opportunity here with the Knight of Cups. So Gemini, um, if you're recently out of a relationship or divorced um, or separated, I definitely see uh, there's a soulmate coming in for you. 
all right a new soulmate and some of you i feel like this could be somebody that you know that maybe they just came out of a relationship or divorce or something like that or um you were in a relationship with this person in the past okay so i was clarifying here the three of cups we got the seven of swords we have the eight of pentacles oh we got the five of wands what's going on here got the eight of cups and we got the knight of cups on the bottom of the deck here now we have all the energies on the board but we do have strong virgo taurus Sagittarius. I pick up a lot of fire, so Aries and Leo as well. Um, or could be even another Gemini here, but they could be any sign, so just know that. We have the Seven of Swords, we have the Eight of Pentacles, we have the Five of Wands, and we have the Eight of Cups. So I do get Gemini, actually, I feel like there could be multiple people here involved um, in this situation, especially if you got a new love coming in. I'm going to say, and this isn't going to be all of you, some of you could actually be leaving a current situation you're in for a new person that's coming into your life. Um, not that I'm telling anybody to leave a situation, but um, I'm also getting here to reconciliation. Reconciliation here with someone as well, or just a new love. But there's an energy here of I'm going to say some of you may be done working on a situation okay. and some of you may just be deciding to be single, uh, to go out, have fun, maybe date. So let's see what else. Uh, what else can you show Gemini? What else can you show Gemini? Okay, so we got a King of Pentacles. We have a World card, Aquarius, Taurus, Scorpio energy there. And we have an Empress, okay, and we have a Five of Cups, okay, interesting. Let's see what's below the Five of Cups, oh, a Two of Cups. Somebody's having regrets here. Someone's having regrets about a situation, and I feel there's going to be an opportunity here with the Empress, the World, and the King of Pentacles. I feel like the, there is definitely someone showing up in your energy, Gemini, that there's going to be an opportunity for you and this person to communicate, to talk. And this is someone I feel, and I'm going to, before I say anything, I just want to pull three more cards. Let's get three more cards for Gemini. Two of Swords, Nine of Pentacles, Four of Cups, okay, and Six of Wands, all right, or Six of Swords, I should say, all right. Yeah, some of you I'm definitely picking up distance here. This person, I feel, too, has been spying on you, whoever this is. I feel like you, you're going to have more than one opportunity here, Gemini. I'm just picking up that energy here in your read. But I feel like there's somebody else, too, this King of Pentacles and the Two of Swords. I feel like this is somebody um, who has really held back from making decisions here about this connection or relationship. And because of that, um, what I feel here is you do have the Empress and the Four of Cups. And the energy I get there is that you're going to be hesitant, I feel, about this person. I get an energy here, right? You may be, um, you know, you may get some communication from this person and I feel uh, you're being guided here by spirit to really listen to what this person has to say, what they have to offer, because this is somebody who was um, indecisive in the past. And I feel like it was somebody who really didn't communicate well what they wanted to say to you or they didn't communicate is the energy that I get because they're coming back around with, with something to say, something they want to either confess apologize there's something that is on their chest i feel like they want to say to you gemini and you have the world card and you have the nine of pentacles i feel gemini it's an energy you're just doing you um, it feels like a very independent energy and i feel like you're open to new things here not just this person as i said i feel like for some of you you may be going out dating um you know taking care of yourself uh, I see here too with this Nine of Pentacles, you may even be 
right? Changing your look, your hair, your wardrobe, whatever it is. But I see a change, a change for the better in you, Gemini, is what I'm seeing here. Very attractive energy. Now, in the extended, Gemini, we're going to look, um, like I said, the next three weeks energy. We will look at what they're thinking, feeling about you, their upcoming actions, intentions, love notes, and guidance as well. So I hope to see you there. I hope you enjoyed this reading. I hope you have a wonderful rest of the day or evening. And I'm sending you angel love.